I look forward to seeing each and every one of you at the Creation Festivals, at Sunshine and Creation Ictus. You know, something incredible happens when tens of thousands of us gather together underneath the sun, the moon, and the stars to worship the one who spoke everything into existence. You know, music and food, making memories that last a lifetime, who can argue with that? But I also know the heart behind the festivals is really to draw attention to how incredible Jesus is. And I look forward to being with you and sharing a piece of my heart with you. You know, in the Bible, there's a story about a guy named Moses who one day he found himself out in nature, similar to what we will be in this summer. And he slowed down just long enough to notice that there was a bush off to the side and the bush was on fire, but it wasn't consumed. And something as simple as slowing down long enough to notice made all of the difference. There were about two million slaves, victims of human trafficking at this time in history in the nation of Egypt. And Moses, when he slowed down long enough to notice the bush and he heard the voice of God, he actually became an answer to the prayer of those two million slaves. And God used Moses to end injustice. You know, all throughout the earth, everybody's talking about human rights. And it is an injustice for someone to die because they don't have access to clean drinking water. It is an injustice for someone to be sold into modern day slavery. And if anyone cares about human rights and injustice, it's, it's Jesus. But the human right is to know Jesus. And the greatest injustice in all of the earth is for someone to live and die without knowing him. We're going to have a lot of fun this summer. and can't wait to see you. But it's also my prayer that this summer, God would change your life. He would change our lives so that we not only make a difference, but we make the difference through Jesus Christ.